This video introduces the Loper, the newest search and rescue robot developed by the Center for Distributed Robotics at the University of Minnesota. It is shown here with two of our Scout robot platforms. The Loper gets its name from the way in which it lopes about, as can be seen in this side view of it. Note how it bobs up and down as it moves across the scene. The key feature of the Loper is its unique wheel design. The shape of the wheels allows the Loper to climb stairs and other obstacles. The dimensions of the wheels are such that they are perfectly suited to climb regular stairs. Here we demonstrate the Loper's stair climbing ability. Notice how well the wheels grip the individual steps, allowing the Loper to elegantly ascend the staircase. It can be seen that these stairs are not perfectly suited to the dimensions of the wheels by the way the Loper bobs up and down while climbing. Nevertheless, the Loper can still climb them quite well. Here we demonstrate that the Loper can climb down a staircase with as much ease as it can climb up one. Note again how the Loper's body bobs up and down as it moves, demonstrating that the stairs are not perfectly suited to its dimensions. Another noteworthy feature of the Loper is its floating frame. Because its components float, the Loper can twist and deform quite a bit without damage. Here we see the Loper's floating frame in action. Because the wheels are set to be out of sync with each other, the body of the robot twists and flexes as it moves across the flat terrain as shown. The floating frame of the Loper allows this to occur with no ill effects. So far, we have just seen the Loper operate on specific man-made surfaces, flat ground and stairs. Here, the Loper climbs into a large pipe, travels through it, and then climbs out and proceeds across a grassy terrain. We will now go further off-road, venturing into more chaotic terrain. The Loper's unique wheel design is useful for climbing more than just stairs. Here, we see the Loper climbing over an icy, snowy pile. Despite its wheels slipping a little, the Loper is able to successfully get over this obstacle. It then heads off into the rough, wooded terrain beyond. Finally, we see the Loper demonstrating its off-road metal by navigating through this rough and rocky creek bed. To a robot this size with normal wheels, this would form an impassable barrier. But for the Loper, it can be seen how the grip and climbing ability provided by its unique wheels combined with its inherent flexibility make this task possible. We hope that you have enjoyed this demonstration of the Loper, the newest search and rescue robot from the University of Minnesota. Thank you.